Hey guys, welcome to the video on how I made an augmented reality app for these little cutie astronauts from Among Us. For those of you who don't know what Among Us is, are you living on a damn rock? Just kidding. Among Us is the most played game right now. It is... Uh, it is... Um, it is about finding a murder in a group of people. So basically like Werewolf and Secret Hitler. But still it's the most played game. And I, as smart as I am, wondered how can I profit from the game. The first option was to just play the game and make funny gameplays and commentaries. But I'm really not a good gamer. I also cannot do 3D models besides a donut I made a week ago. But you know what I can do really, I mean really good? Cool autotune songs. Every night and every day Oh, I try to make you stay But you're... No, stop it, okay? I'm really good at programming the little things on your smartphone you literally use every day. Uh, not these things? So I decided to use this skill in combination with Among Us to make something great. Something which is technologically on another level. Something which has the power to unite all of us. I wanted to make an AR character viewer for Among Us astronauts because I can't program games like some other dudes. Yay. So my mission was defined, but what do I need for a mission like this? Backpack, show them what we need. First of all, we need to design the app. Second, we need a 3D model of an astronaut. Third, we need to learn how to embed this 3D model into the augmented reality. Fourth, we need to implement the app. Fifth, we need to implement no ads because I don't need money. And the last one, we need to publish the app for free? Wait a minute. Backpack, I will not publish it for free, okay? I need my money for a name G, you know? So, without hesitations, let's start the mission. Designing the app was really the easiest part of the whole mission because I have usability engineering skills and because the app will only have like two screens. So I opened my favorite UI design app and started designing an astronaut. Yes, I had to design these 2D astronauts by myself because I haven't found pre-designed assets. Then I designed the home and the AR screen, which was weird because you cannot design an AR view because you actually need a camera view. But yeah, so the final design looked like this. Looks pretty cool, right? Then I needed a 3D model of an Among Us astronaut. And as it was planned, someone named the Average Joe uploaded a 3D model which was perfect for my needs. I downloaded the model and converted it to a file format called USDZ, which I haven't heard in my life before. But you guys know Apple damn well. They always have like these special extra things, like this file format. The unfortunate part about this was I couldn't convert it 100% correct, so at the end I got an astronaut with no black borders, which is fine I guess. The next step was to learn about Apple's augmented reality kit, which is called AR kit. You see, the guys from Apple were really creative there. After reading the documentations for like 10 minutes, I understood everything and started programming. Which is a lie, obviously. The reality was, I watched many tutorials on YouTube and copied like the half of the code. But still, I understood. Let's come to the most difficult part, implementing the app. Because I had a brief design of the app, everything was like a routine for me. I created a view controller and placed everything from the home screen in it, including a collection view for the previews of astronauts, a button to show them an AR and an info box. Then I created the primitive classes for the astronaut and defined 10 of them, each one with a specific color image. I collected everything into a list and defined an initializer which of course initializes the list. After that I gave the collection view the list as the input and the collection view showed my 2D astronauts on the screen. Okay, I know. That sounded a bit too tacky, I guess, but you can just read the documentation of each term I used to better understand everything. So let's go on. I then created the different scenes in my experience file and placed each of the different color 3D models of the astronauts in them. And then, oh wait, 
the app was finished. Everything worked fine and I was pretty excited I managed it on the first try. Hey, tell the truth, man. Okay, okay. Obviously, it wasn't at the first try. I had to make a lot of adjustments and corrections, but finally the app was ready. You can even edit the photo you took and design it with stickers, which is definitely not the work of another guy whose framework I just used with my little Coco friend. Anyway, and now the biggest question was, should I include ads in the app which annoy everyone by showing strange things? Oh wait, did I say biggest question? I meant biggest rhetorical question, because of course I will implement ads. So I implemented the ads from Google AdMob, which is the biggest mobile ad platform. I fixed some last bugs and it was finally time to deploy the app. Now guys, for the next decision, I want all of your empathy. I put it on the app store for 99 cents. I know, I know, how can I do this? It should be free, because it was created for a YouTube video and you guys want to test it too, I know. And it will be free, I promise, but not in the first week. So if you are watching this in time between 16th October 2020 and 23rd October of 2020, the app is for sale for 99 cents. But if you are a late visitor, shame on you, it will be free because I'm a human as well and I want you to test the hell out of the app and enjoy it. And yeah, this was the video on how I made an AR viewer for Among Us. I hope you enjoyed the video. And I also hope you will test the app, it is available on the App Store only. Link is in the description. Stay healthy guys and leave a like if you enjoyed the video and also subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. Bye.